I think science makes it a little harder to sell a false argument. And to a certain extent, that's kind of as I see it about all that science can do. The basic problem that I work with is trying to model the economic trade-off between ecosystem services and what you might call users that uh, potentially damage the ecosystem. Which groups of effectors, which groups of enjoyers are going to loom larger, pushing the political system to design and affect regulation? You know, try to remove some of this political uncertainty. Which way the ultimate political equilibrium is going to shift? We use lakes as a kind of an iconic, canonical example because a lot is known about the food web of lake systems and alternative stable states of lake systems. You could actually articulate a lot of what goes on in Mendota or even in an economy by using good common sense. So you might ask, why do people bother to build models at all? Well, the point is, is you want to quantify the common sense. So you want to be able to actually put quantitative numbers on the common sense. What we did is we created this power index. We uh, looked at the distribution of value to the stakeholders on each side. It looks like a probability distribution. What you would try to predict is that if the technical uh, aspects of, of the enjoyer distribution, like whether there's a small number of really large enjoyers, you know, I'll just give a hypothetical example. A couple of billionaires that have extremely large estates on the shores of Lake Mendota that are being ruined by uh, slimy water. Well, you can imagine how large those two billionaires would loom in a small legislature like Wisconsin. So if you had a, a situation of where the power indices were approximately equal on each side, then this actually gives a, a political reformer room to maneuver because it can kind of just steer right between Scylla and Charybdis, as it were. But if it's totally imbalanced on one side, you know, then you can pretty much predict uh, the pressure is just going to be overwhelming on that side. 